Introduction Wow! How beautiful is this garden? What are you looking, Alia? I'm looking at a garden picture. Alia, can you analyze the different objects in this picture? Yes, there are benches, slider, fountain, flower bed, etc. Children, now analyze the shapes of different objects in this picture. The shape of the bench is a rectangle. The shape of the flower bed is a square. Slider's shape is triangle. The shape of fountain pond is a circle. These are called the plain geometrical figures. In this lesson, we will learn property of different geometrical figures. Objectives At the end of this lesson, you will be able to Perimeter of squares and rectangles Areas of squares and rectangles Area of a triangle Area of parallelogram Circumference and area of a circle Unit conversions Perimeter of squares and rectangles Students, can you measure the boundary of flower bed in the park? Yes, by measuring the sides of flower bed. So, perimeter of a shape is the outer boundary of the shape. So, the perimeter of squares is the sums of the sides of squares. You understood what is perimeter? Can you find the perimeter of rectangular bench in the park? Yes, we have the measures of the length and breadth of rectangle. The perimeter of rectangle is the sums of its lengths and breadths. Area of squares and rectangles Students, can you identify the shape of flower bed in the park? It is the shape of square. A square is a four-sided closed figure with equal measures. Can we find the area inside the flower bed? Yes, if we have measure of any one side, we can find the area. The area of squares is the square it sides. You have noticed the shape of the bench in the park. It is in the shape of rectangle on sitting top portion. Can you find the area of top bench? Yes. If you have measures of length and breadth of rectangle, we can find the area. The area of rectangle is the product of its length and breadth. Triangle What is triangle? A triangle is a three-sided closed figure. Have you noticed the slider in the park? It is in the shape of triangle. So can we find the area of a triangle? Yes. We can also find the area of a triangle by using the formula for area of triangle. For this, we require the measures of base and the height of triangle. Area of triangle is the half the product of its height and base. Parallelogram Students, see the following figure? Can you name the figure? It is parallelogram. A parallelogram is four-sided closed figure having opposite sides parallel to each other. Can we find the area of this figure? Yes, by using the formula for the area of parallelogram. For this you require the measures of base and distance between corresponding parallel sides. Area of a parallelogram is the product of its base and the distance between the parallel sides, that is, height of parallelogram. Circles Students, have you noticed the shape of fountain? The fountain is in the shape of circle. Can you measure the circumference of the circle? Yes. If you know the radius of circle, then by using the formula of circumference of circle. Circumference of a circle is the distance around a circular region. In other words, the boundary of circle. Circumference of a circle is the product of a constant called pi and its diameter or twice the product of pi and radius of circle. Students, can we also find the area of circle? Yes, if we know the measure of radius of circle. Area of a circle is equal to pi times the square of radius. Or we can also express area of circle in terms of diameter. We know that radius of circle is half of diameter. 
So, area of a circle in this case is equal to constant pi times the square of half of diameter. Unit conversions. We know that in one centimeter there are 10 millimeters. In one meter there are 100 centimeters. In one kilometer there are 1000 meters. In one hectare there are 100 meters. Sometimes we require changing from bigger unit to smaller unit. Now we know the basic of unit system so we can easily convert from bigger unit to smaller unit as following. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. Perimeter of squares and rectangles Areas of squares and rectangles Area of triangle Area of parallelogram Circumference and area of a circle Unit conversions